What's up guys, it's King Josh back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys the fastest way to get all 7 chests in Wailing Woods. So first of all, I want to say this challenge is a lot easier than you may think and the best way to do it is by playing 50v50. So when your team has their side of the bus on the side of Wailing Woods, so either the right side or the north side, you're gonna wanna go to Wailing Woods and if you're on the west side, you're gonna be coming from the bottom of Wailing Woods and the way to get to the chest the fastest is by getting the best jump out of all your teammates. So there are gonna be some people going there even if the circle is far from there just because they also wanna complete this challenge but you're gonna wanna go all the way down by these two hills right here that you can see on the map. Maybe even before that, just so you can get as low as possible. And there are some chests scattered throughout the woods, but if you wanna finish this challenge in the fastest way possible, you're gonna wanna go to the center of Wailing Woods, and in the very center, there's one chest there, and then there's one chest in every corner of the maze. So there aren't going to be 5 chests that spawn every time, but right here you can see that some guy took the middle chest, so I ended up taking this chest, and right when you get a chest, you're going to want to run to the next corner, and you can possibly get more than one chest in one game. Like some games I got one chest, this game right here I got two chests, and some games I even got three chests, so it's pretty much based on luck, and who goes there, and how close the bus is, and all that stuff. But if the circle is far from Wailing Woods, then that's probably going to be your best bet when the least number of people are going there. So this should take around 3 matches, maybe 4 matches, but this should not take you long at all. And right here you guys can see this is pretty much the same jump as the last clip I showed you guys. And I did get used to the jump after a while because it was the same thing every time pretty much and I did end up getting the chest in the middle. I'm going to speed this clip up right here a little bit, but once again, in 50v50, the jumps are pretty much the same every time. As you can see, those are the two hills right there. I got low by them, and I got a really low jump into the center of Wailing Woods, and I got that chest pretty easily. So that's going to be it for the video, and basically to sum things up, all that you want to do is play 50v50, and you're going to want to get a really good landing and you're going to want to get low by the two hills, but you're not going to want to be directly above them because then you're going to pull your glider super high, so you're just going to go to the left or to the right or maybe even behind those two hills that I showed you guys earlier in the video. And if you guys have any questions on this, feel free to leave a comment down below. I'll answer your question. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Drop a like if you enjoyed the video. Make sure to share this video with your friends if it helped you complete this challenge in any way. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'm out. Peace.